everybody and welcome to a bonus episode of Minecraft Short Stories. In this episode, we have a guest over. Everyone, this is Grayson Wynn. Yeah, thanks for having me. Yeah, anytime. In this episode, Grayson's going to be telling a... He's going to be answering a few questions I have about like his survival world and he's going to be helping me tell a story where I like found hero brands on my world. segment in this segment i'm going to ask grayson some questions but before all that uh we're gonna say what happened with the hero brands in my world so i'm gonna begin so i was searching for loot inside a mine shaft that i found in a ravine and i found it like so there's this tunnel with like water going down it and i jumped down into the water and i went up and i there's mine sh- there's like a mine shaft right next to it so i went in there and then at a section of the mine shaft, instead of regular torches, there was redstone torches. And at the end of the hallway was a mossy cobblestone cross. And next to it was a chest with a redstone torch in it, and behind that was an empty sign. And all this was down a redstone 2 by one tunnel lined with redstone torches. The floor was netherite. And as I went down the tunnel, I saw that there was lava at the end. Good thing I brought my bucket, I thought. I searched until I found the source of the lava, and then as it drained away, as Grayson said, there was a mossy stone cross. It was made out of cracked brick, mossy stone, and it was on the edge of a one block deep pit that looked, and it was all inside like a kind of natural and man-made feeling kind of cave. Because, you know, it's made by, like, Hero Brian. But all this goes to say that Hero Brian is not happy with me. And another thing about Hero Brian is that that's not the only thing he's done. He has also broken my glass, which is really annoying. Because then I have to go, like, mine more glass, smelt the glass, make a window. Okay, it's so annoying, Hero Brian. But. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna be forced to have my own world. I'm gonna stay in my world because I actually really like that world. But I am gonna be more on my guard. Okay, now it's time for the questions with our guest Grayson. I'm going to ask him about five questions, and we're gonna kind of discuss what he's doing. Okay, so Grayson, the first question is: Have you found any signs of here around your world? Anything? abnormal or strange well i don't think i found anything wrong um i didn't i didn't um experience any redstone tunnels when i was mining yeah anything like abnormal not just like redstone tunnels that's like a definite sign but something weird like a creeper blew up your house two times in a row in the exact same place something like that no um I don't think your Brian has is in my world. Well, I'm very happy for you because I think that how Hero Brian works is that it's like a very small chance that he'll be in a world, and then there's a very small chance that he'll interact like multiple times. Like he'll actually be like trolling you, uh, being creepy. I think it's just like one creepy thing, like but there's like a small chance that it could be really creepy. Do you think this may be like a good theory um yes a a fairly good theory um yeah yeah i think that mojang did that because if i was the owner of a company and there was like this creepypasta legend thing going around i think i would take advantage of it and let some creators get some good content on their youtube videos yes i would too um like, I would also take advantage of it and try to creep out people who are playing Minecraft or make them have more fun with it. Yes. Shall we go on to the next question? Yes. Okay, next question. What was the hardest thing that you think you have done inside your survival world or Minecraft? Well, um, I have, I just started a world and yeah, I think it was trying to find a, find sheep or yeah, finding sheep because um, where I spawned, 
around the area, there were, I found, like, no sheep. Yeah, sometimes finding sheep can be a real hassle. Okay, is that the hardest thing? Well, um, there was more. I was trying to kill, um, an iron golem, but I couldn't lead it far enough away. Or, because there was, there were lots of gardens in this village, and, um, I couldn't, and I, and I couldn't really build high enough because I didn't, I didn't really have enough blocks, so. Yeah, I did hear that mm-hmm. you should make, like, to kill an iron golem, like all the speedrunners do, you tower up, like, five blocks, maybe, and then, like, you hit it with, like, an axe, like, or, like, a sword, critical hitting by, like, you know, jumping and hitting them. But I tried to do this. I am a pocket edition player, and... I made stairs to the top of the thing since I was trying to hit the iron golem, and then I guess I didn't. I didn't think it out, of course, since the iron golem, you know, took advantage of those stairs. Yes, and in the end, I lost my stuff because of that. Um, be I was where I was where I was. Um, my respawn my respawn point was. It was a little far away, and it was kind of hard to reach there. So, and it was a little far away too. So. When I, by, by the time I reached it again, my stuff was gone, oh. and I, and I had to restart. However, in the end, I killed in the iron golem. Yes, I hate when your stuff despawns. I have lost many good things that way. Okay, let's get on to the third question. Third question is: What do you like? What do you like your houses to look like? Like tons of windows, or slanted roof, or like a village house? Well. I have I have a couple I have a couple of opinions on that. If it was if I had to do if your if Hero Brown was in your world, I would have no windows and 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 an in enclosed space. However, generally, I like um, bigger houses with more windows, so I have more freedom and I have more freedom to move around and put more storage and stuff. Yeah, I always well I didn't I don't like really love windows in houses, but whenever I make a house, it seems. At the end, it seems to have every single wall is more window than wood. For example, in my survival world right now, I have a three-story acacia house. And th- I'm there's a lot of windows, let's just say that. But I just can't seem to find a balance between windows and wood. Well, I um, sort of place windows in my walls, two on each wall. I don't put too many in. Depending on the size of my house, I put two or one in each wall, or sometimes even one. Yeah, I definitely have a problem with that. Let's get on to the fourth and next to last question. Let's, the question is, have you made like your house that you wanted to make? Cause you were just, I was just, the last question was, what kind of houses do you like? Have well, you made one that you well, really like? Well, because my stuff despawned, um, it's been kind of hard to get along, but in the end, I, I got along there. So, actually, I did. I, um, I have some considerable progress in the house, in my dream house. Okay. Let's get on to the final question. Have you ever beaten the Wither or the Ender Dragon without, like, cheats or by yourself? Or have you gone Ooh. close? Um... I've, I've, um, actually found, um, the place where the Elder Dragon is. The stronghold? However, the stronghold. And I've explored, but in the end, I, I haven't really found it. But I have gone with a friend and almost beaten it, but. And for the Wither, I, I have never really beaten the Wither. I actually have a stronghold under a village, that's still technically in my house since all my items are inside of it. Because I've not finished, like, moving into my house in the savannah. But there's a stronghold right under that village, and I've actually found the portal room in it. And it also has, like, two ro- libraries. So, but I've never been the Wither or the Ender Dragon by myself. And I haven't really gone close. But, yeah, thanks for answering these questions, Grayson. Everyone, it is now time for a quiz. The question is, what is the main loot of an ocean monument? A. Diamond blocks. B. Sponges. C. Gold blocks. 
or D, iron and kelp. Take a moment to gather your decision. The answer is C, gold blocks. Submit your short story. Go to minecraftshortstory.com. No caps, no spaces, and submit your short story. If you want to contact me, go to the contact me page also there. Thank you all so much for listening. If you want to listen to my podcast or submit your short story, go to minecraftshortstories.com. Thank you all for listening. Bye.